this is Congressman Eric Paulson. It's actually been two months since I was first sworn in as a member of Congress to the freshman class here, and it's been a really exciting opportunity. And I've been working hard for all of my constituents in the 3rd District. Uh, there have been some real challenges. In particular, I'm very concerned about some of the spending bills we've passed. Uh, since I've actually been here in Congress, we've already spent $1.5 trillion in various spending initiatives. First, we have the $790 billion stimulus package that actually is about a trillion dollars when you include the debt payments that are a part of that bill. And then last week we just had the final vote on a $410 billion supplemental omnibus bill. And that's actually an 8% increase in spending in many government programs, one of the highest percentage increases in the history of the country. And uh, I did not support that legislation and that was part of the $1.5 trillion that we have now spent. I don't know many of my constituents, if any, that are getting an 8% increase in their paychecks. And actually all of this money that is being spent in Congress is borrowed money. And so we've added $1.5 trillion now to the national debt. And our budget deficit stands at a record $1.7, $1.8 trillion in one year alone for this year. So we have our challenges ahead. We also passed a housing bill this year and I did support a strong housing legislative initiative that really would provide real assistance for folk, those people who have had their homes foreclosed on now. The bill that passed, I think, is really going to be detrimental towards mortgage holders across the country, uh, those who have been honestly paying for their mortgages right now. And it has the tendency to potentially raise rates, which I'm very concerned about. So we've had some differences of opinion, uh, to be sure. I just have to say that uh, there are a lot of small businesses and families and people in the 3rd District that are having some difficult times right now, that people are hurting, and uh, I'm going to keep working as hard as I can to make sure that Congress here is focused on job creation and working on the priorities of the 3rd Congressional District. It's been an eventful and a very important few months in Congress. I would encourage you to keep in touch with myself and my staff, uh, both in Washington and in Minnesota in the days and months ahead, and you'll be hearing more from us. Thank you very much.